where napping is really important to appreciate is in our youngsters. So as we said, the youngsters tend to be a delayed chronotype. So they'll go to bed late and they'll want to wake up late. But that can be exaggerated by social media. You know, they're working until the, the early hours of the morning, you know, doing whatever they do. So they get up, um, they struggle through the school day. Um, and teachers tell me, you know, literally kids are falling asleep at the desk. They get home and then they'll have a two hour sleep. And what that does is push back the sleep pressure, making it more difficult to get to sleep that night. So you've got the delayed chronotype of youngsters coupled with a reduction in, in, in sleep pressure, meaning you're not going to get that extended period of sleep at night. You wake up or you you don't wake up, you're woken up. You then struggle through the school day and you can get into a really difficult cycle of longer and longer naps um, and shorter and shorter nighttime sleep and a failure to function optimally during the day. And as I say, that's a particular issue for our youngsters.